Hi everybody, welcome to our video from the War Feature Planetarium. As you're trapped in your houses at the moment, we thought we'd still give you a chance to look at the nighttime sky. And we have a great event going on right now in the nighttime sky. I'm sure you've probably seen as the sun goes down the very bright object in the western sky uh, that's up as the sun goes down. That is the planet Venus. It's the third brightest thing in the sky after the sun and the moon. But you're probably wondering where all the other planets are. Well, the answer to that is in the morning sky just before the sun comes up. The brightest object in the southeastern sky by about 5.30, 6 o'clock in the morning is the planet Jupiter. Being the biggest planet in the solar system, it's the fourth brightest thing in the sky after Venus. It is bunched up with two other planets. Just to the right of uh, Jupiter is the much dimmer but still brilliant planet of Mars in the nighttime sky. And down into the left of that pair is the planet Saturn. Now, when you have planets so close together as they are in the early morning sky, we call this a planetary conjunction. And this week, we have another great event happening with that, too. The moon is in the area. As a matter of fact, on March 18th, the moon is going to be just below Jupiter in the sky, so the three planets and the moon will form a diamond. Even as the moon moves past those planets over the next few days, for the next several weeks, you will have those three planets in the early morning sky uh, very close to each other. And anytime you get a clear sky, go out and take a look. You'll be able to see them from about five o'clock in the morning until the sun comes up. So go out and look up.